Hello my fan pals and welcome back and if you're new here then thank you for joining me and giving me a try. My name is Di, I am here at Creative Karma Design and today I'm doing a little update on my face planner and I'm going to share with you how I am currently using it and changes that I've made and we're going to decorate a page in my tarot planner for the first week of May. This is something that I put together myself. I do have a video, I will link it here, but this is basically a, a bound cover from a journal that I got from Walmart for cheap. I don't like the bound, so I took it apart, put the horizontal planner inside, put a horizontal planner inside, a happy planner inside, made my own dividers, etc etc i did have a cover on the front i don't know what i did with those but i did have a cover on the front like a frosted cover because i didn't like the feel of this but i've grown used to it i thought i might i kind of like it now so yes i am now using it without the frosted cover which i think is a beautiful so again i made all of this like diy'd it when i did it i did it with patterned paper this is I think this is die cuts with a view paper from I think I bought this from Joann's or Hobby Lobby I can't remember which but this is a couple of years old it is the Luna I think pack from die cuts with a view I've got the little Avery tabs um, and then I just made the months with my label maker so that's the overview of how I made it for January I used the Agenda 52, I think, yeah, I think it was Agenda 52, I don't remember what the book was called, I kind of liked it and I used the grey pen with it, again, I would put my fall and my new moon stickers in, I literally just put the date, the card, I put a few little headers of the points of the card, and then I journal about what I think it means for me on that day. So that's how I've been using that. And then February, I did the washi tape shop, Violet Bliss, with some washi. And I asked you in the video whether you thought I should use the purple pen or the green pen. I used both. <laughs> I used both. I'm really glad that I did because I kind of like it. And I just carried on using that. Just used the washi, the Violet Bliss and use that the whole month and I just changed as you can see I just changed how I used it each week I've got the horizontal here got the horizontal here but I added boxes I've got the horizontal here but with gold boxes and then this I just outlined it and then put the boxes in so yeah I just used it a little differently each time and then March I used the washi tape shop I don't remember which one this is, but I will link it down below regardless. And I used a brown pen as my card of the day. And then I don't think you can see, but this is actually a kind of bronze colored pen for my journaling. Um, and then again, I just carried on doing my thing every day. Maybe you can see that there is actually writing there. It's just hard to see. And I did that. So then we come to April. For April, I chose the washi, washi tape shop, the Tea Temptations, because I hadn't used it yet, and it is gorgeous. I'm really happy that I did. All I did, and I've done the same thing pretty much every week, every spread, solid washi, grid washi, and then just plopped the, the washi stickers on top of it. I've used two pens. I used the blue and the brown because it kind of pulls from the washi tape. Again, blue and brown here. I think I prefer the tan and the tan colored grid as well. Love this, love this, love. And then I use the blue again here just to close out so that it's got the same color on the close out. So that's how I've been using it. I just literally come in, write my card, write the date, a few little points, bullet points from the standard interpretation of the card and then what I think the card means for me for that day. That's it. So then I come to May. What am I going to do for May? Well, the planner stash challenge for May for the sticker books is to use some kind of mystical celestial type book. 
And I thought I would use Stargazer and I'd go back to how I was using it in January and do it a little bit more staggered and haphazard. Staggered and haphazard is what I want to say. And because my divider here is this kind of tealy color, I'm thinking of using this in the Stargazer rather than the purple. And I can use purple on the other weeks, but I think that is going to look beautiful opposite there. So I'm just going to use this one. And again, this is an out of date horizontal. I just wipe the date out and I've done the same on here. I just wipe the date out and I will come in, pen it in or put it in a little box or something like that. I really don't mind. I've picked up two washi tapes that kind of match. This one is a beautiful match. And this is another quick tip for you. If you're looking for washi tapes in your stash and you find one, put a little bit of it on the page. So I'm going to use this. I'm thinking top, bottom, maybe in the middle. I'm not sure yet. But yeah, that is the plan. I'm thinking top and bottom and we shall see. I will leave links to whatever I can in the description as always. But yes, I think I'm going to put some in the top, some on the bottom, and then just be a bit more free with my with my spread. I am trying, trying to get a little bit ahead because I just feel so out of sorts right now. I am so behind. Today is the 30th. <laughs> Tomorrow is May when I'm supposed to be using this freaking planner. <laughs> and here I am. Here I am. Not done. I'm going to put that right there on that gray line. Where's that little thing gone? And I think that be that. That is lovely. Yes. I love this color. I love this color. And again, I think I'm going to put some on the bottom. I'm just going to do the same thing. I'm just going to put it right on the bottom. Right on the bottom. So yes, if you have a faith or a tarot, whatever it is, whatever your faith is, why don't you let me know how you're doing with yours? I'm not saying that I'm in mine every day but most days, most days I do pop in. So let's see what we're gonna do with this. I've got a little bit of wax paper here. I'm thinking, thinking of using this like here, like here, and then we'll put a box with it maybe. Oh, I've got some blue here, hang on. Is that blue? Yes, but some blue foil, of course we have. I don't know why the purple isn't in foil, but hey, hey, whatever, happy planner. <laughs> whatever, happy planner. So I'm thinking that there, and then I'm gonna put another one in. Another one at least, maybe two. This is how I like it, and then I can put the card here, journal about it there, and then we put another one here. So maybe we put... I'm feeling in this one, which is odd. I didn't think I would be drawn to this one, but here we are. And I think I might put one of these in. One of the best days, choose to be kind. I think be true to you. Just so that I've kept the shape. I think that's going there. And then, going that. And we end with that one. I kind of like that idea. Kind of like that idea? Anybody else? And then we'll use some boxes. Not those. Boxes. You know. Boxes. Today's plans. Could use those. These. You know what? I might just use these. Those look like a different colour though. Yeah. Do I want to do that? Yeah, maybe. I need four. I've got four. Okay, let's get my stickers. I've only got three there. Hang on. 
So I say this all the time. These are the little dot stickers. You can get them from Dollar Tree. You can get them from anywhere. Actually, these are a little smaller. Are they the same size? Oh, they're the same size. Again, these are from Dollar Tree. They're just little three quarter inch like circle stickers. Um, so I'm going to take those. I'm going to take these because they say date night, movie night, market, really market, lounge. I've got nothing. Um, and I'm just going to literally put one there. And for this, I'm just going to put, I'm going to put some white, um, I could just put two sticker sticker things on. I'm just going to put that on there. I'm just going to put two on so that it's not going to see it underneath. Yeah. And then I can put the date in there is what I was thinking. Yes, I think we're going to do that. Let me get some more of that sticker paper again. Again, this is why I like these dots, these dot things, because sometimes these things make no sense. Like this one's not too bad, but lounge is pretty freaking stupid. Market is stupid. Just saying, I don't need friend night, really. So yes. And I'm going to put this in my little package thing where I'm keeping my I've used stick stickers and stuff. That can go there. Yes. And that can go there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think we're going for it. Let's just do it. This is going here. This one will go here. I'm not sure if I want to put that over the over the thing there or there. No, I think it's there. Just a little further down. Yes. And then that I put that there. And then for this one, it can go there. Hang on, I might be changing these around a little bit. I'll put that there, put that there. Yes, let's do that. And then this one can go here. I think that one needs to go there. Do I need something else there? Hang on. I just feel like that actually might be better off. Hang on, if I can get this up, I just feel like the, the date needs to go on the date, you know, the, the hole, the hole, the date hole needs to go on the day. That doesn't bother me as much. This one needs to go here. And this one needs to go here. So we need to put something else in. I really don't like all the holographic crap in here either. Those are too big. Is it one of these? No, I don't think so. Oh, about that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hang on. I'm just going to change that and put that there. Yes. I could, if I wanted to, put another one on the other side. Mm. Yes. Okay, there we go. And then, and then we'll put some of these things in. Yes. And then let's put that one there. Yes. I'm clearly not going to use all of these, but I want to use some just to fill in the little gaps there. And again, for the other pages, I'm probably going to do get off the sheet. The different colors and my plan would be to use as much 
of these shapes as possible this month because I just, I stick with the, the the same theme the whole month as you saw so yes that would be fantastic do I want to put a little starry line there like that very thin starry line I'm just gonna literally cut that in half long ways I do but I also have to write on this so maybe it's there it's there isn't it it's there okay never mind And that can go there. Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Yep. And. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's done. But do you see how that can come together? And then the other thing that I will do is when I find my scratch paper. Where's my paper pad gone? I swear, I think I spend half of my life in this room looking for stickers, looking for a paper. So now the next step is I literally get out all of my pens and decide what pens I'm going to use. All right, so at the end of my gone through all of my pens, I've narrowed it down to three headers for my card of the day. And I'm thinking this one. Anybody else thinking this one? I think this one's too blue, although it does match the the foil really well. It does match the foil really well. But I'm thinking this one because I'm going to use the grey. And I think it's the one that least contrasts with the grey. Though I am kind of drawn to that one as well. Uh, I think that's the darker. That, no, it's not that one. So I'm either going to use this blue this kind of deep grey and the kind of silver metallic pen and that is my pens for May well at least the first week of May when I'm using this I probably will keep this pen but change the header color depending on whether I'm using this teal or the purple these will live in my planner tote where I keep my planner so I'm just going to put those in there because I've done with my brown for this month and that my friends is my first week in my tarot planner sorted i really like how that matches this i really like that i really like that i like it when it matchy matches love it i've used my stargazer book for the first time ever ever <laughs> and i have two of these suckers so yes I am really happy with this. Again, I like this. I like this. It does something different that I don't normally do. So yes, and I will write the date in there, I think. That's going to be the thing. I'll just write the date in there and that will be it. I like it quite a lot. And I've used these bloody half moon circle tombstone-y things as well. All right. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. And I will see you next time, my Planet Pals. Bye.